Hello, fellow Bottom fans. Hey. Uh, start of the new season. Uh, we've just drawn in MK Dons at home. Um, now, I'm going to say, I think this is the game. Didn't go. Didn't listen to it. Uh, did see it. Sort of. <laughs> at times. Missed lots of goals. Really, really has really unbelievably fucked me off. Uh, I don't even know what I've fucked off anyway. Why am I fucked off? Because I follow isn't available this season on the Saturday. You know what? Last season I watched every fucking game on I follow. Every game all season. Uh, because, well, one, because of Covid. But two, because actually I don't live anywhere near the ground even if I could. You know, I can't get to the ground. I can't get to a game because I live too far away. So I follow. Maybe fall in love with Bolton all over again. And I can't do that this season unless I watch my big games, which I will be doing. Trust me, I will be doing. I follow, we'll get used a lot at midweek. We'll get used every midweek, whenever Bolton are playing midweek. But it's very frustrating. Anyway, the fact is, we drew 3 3. We never give in. Um, we got three goals at home. Yeah, you score three goals at home. You shouldn't really be drawing, but. You know what? The point's better than none. Uh, tends to take away from it. George Johnson made a complete and utter fuck up for the first goal, undoubtedly. Then Jill beat on his fucking near post. What the fuck's going on there? Um, you got to say though, George Johnson did um, redeem himself because he kicked out of the line when Baptiste had fallen. Um, obviously, it was very slippy. Uh, it was very slippy. Um, grass. I mean, it was, let's be honest. Um, but luckily he was on the line when they got past it, uh, they got it past uh, Jilts. So, he's redeemed himself. Um, Josh Sheer, great free kick, fantastic. It's either him or Declan Johnny was going to take it. Declan Johnny's good at free kicks, as we all know. Uh, Josh Sheer, goal, fantastic. Um, the back of Yoko, Akiyoko gets uh, us 2 1 in front. Um, nicely taken goal. Took a nick off the defender, which probably got it past the goalkeeper, but it's a different matter. He obviously hit it hard enough. Uh, played pretty well on game. Uh, it's nice to reserve pass in the first half. But Sasuke Jim was very good. Um, yeah. Um, and then he gives a free kick away to, for them to go and equalise and put it to 2 2. So really, we've had heroes and villains as well, two of new signs, instantly. These things happen, I guess. Um, Sasevich should undoubtedly have had a penalty. I don't understand why he didn't have a penalty. Um, did think at one point they were going to send MJ Williams off. Didn't, thank God. Um, yeah, lost two goals, didn't see. Saw the breakaway, didn't see the goal. Unbelievable. Um, and I didn't see how was either. Uh, but I know perhaps he scored because I was also following it on the Golden News and I was following it on yeah, the club I follow, which gives you the thing even if you're not listening to it and stuff. I was still watching, I was watching that as well. So, you know, uh, <laughs> tell me about what I didn't see. Um, what do you think? What do you think of these signings? Um, I mean, Josh Johnson didn't play badly, to be honest. I mean, he gave a goal away. There's no doubt about that because he's been too clever on the ball, trying to cut inside somebody. But, you know, that's. I guess he'll learn from that. Akiyoko probably shouldn't have made the tackle that he did, but he did. You know what? It, hopefully, he'll learn from that too. Um, Kachunga, I believe, got the, re the um, assist. Well, the goal uh, that Baptiste scored. Um, yeah, I don't really know anything about that. Uh, but we did play too badly. We didn't have as much as the ball in League One as we did in League Two. But I'm assuming that, you know what, this, that, that wasn't going to happen. Um, we, were, we were levels above League Two last season. Um, this season, obviously, we're going to have to learn quickly because League One is a better league than League Two. Just there's better players in it, 
a bit of teams in it. And, you know, we've got to learn from games like today. Um, so hopefully, Everett will get onto it and we'll be sorted. Maybe MK, MK Dons will galvanise um, after the manager walked out. I think it was the, I think it was the captain that was actually taking charge of the team today. Which is like, what the hell? Um, so maybe that galvanised them. Who knows? Maybe that galvanised them and they played out the skins. And that's what, why we ended up 3 3. Uh, what else is this? Uh, uh, maybe Vaughan are also vulnerable at the back. I mean, two wing back, well, not wing backs, you know, right back and left back. And they just zoom up and down the wings constantly. I mean, if it didn't, I'd, let's be honest, Declan John, if we hadn't just over the halfway line, uh, cutting a ball out and then flew down the wing and crossed it over, the back of Yoko wouldn't have scored. But that also leaves us one ball at the back because we've got two defenders and just MJ Williams that's there. So is that going to have to change? Are we going to have to play more through the middle rather than playing down the wings and overload the people? I don't know. Just Sheen has got some nice touches on both of them. So maybe we can do that. Um, we'll see. Let's just see what happens. Well, this isn't a negative today, it's positive. We got a point. That's all that matters. So that's good. Got it, it. Anyway, I'm sure you did enjoy this. Uh, if you did enjoy it, give it a like, give it a share, give it a comment, and give it a subscribe. Even better, still, watch my other channel, uh, Cameron and Blue, because that's two people, not just me. You know, fat, lard ass here talking to you. Hope oh, you enjoyed. Bye.